masses which the boys are wearing during Tibetan opera dancing also they wear these kind of masses we have varieties some looks funny some looks scary when we, when you were in the museum Tibet museum did you notice about the masses different masses yes. okay so those masses we use for uh, Tibet, during the Tibetan opera dancing as well as we have another dancing which we call it chum which we call it chum which is like a religious dancing at that time they put another type of masks okay okay so the next dancing they call, we call it nangma which means settled Tibetan flock song and dancing okay so Lhasa, we call it in our language. In English, it is like the sandal. Okay? So the dress is worn by the ladies. It is like a sandal Tibetan dresses. Throughout Tibet, our cultural dress, we call it chupa, all chupa. But sometimes shape, thickness of the uh, material, it is different. In central Lhasa, more light. Okay? In the east, west, we are very cold much much thicker okay 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 so next song we call it nangma tibetan central tibetan long song and dancing okay these girls and children Oh, that's beautiful hat. Oh,